Would you watch a show where a billionaire CEO has to go an entire month on their lowest paid employee's salary, without access to any other resources than that of the employee? What do you think would happen? They would pump a few million into the area and when they turn up in the first episode there would be a recently refurbished rent controlled place within their price range miraculously available. When they do their shopping the surprisingly low priced basics will allow them to afford a few luxuries that just happen to be on sale. And there would be a strangely well stocked food bank in the area when needed. At the end of the show you would have an interview with the smug prick saying how with just a few smart life hacks you can live very comfortably on their generous pay. They probably more quickly turn their life around and rise the ranks of a corporate ladder again. The people ain't going to want to watch that show. For sake of argument, what do you think the average IQ is for a billionaire CEO? And then the lowest paid employee at a company? It's a show that's going to get awkward fast. Every single person who has the competence and ability to be a CEO of a company that has made them a billionaire, would be able to find a higher paying job than the lowest paying job at a company within a week easily. I would watch it a little, but I think that it would stress me out and that it'd highlight the day-to-day -day struggles I face as a working class I watch TV specifically to forget about for a while. Plus, the show would have to be approved by network executives, many of whom are near if not in the billionaire club, and they wouldn't want to bring further awareness to class inequality to their consumers. It would incite so much more class rage than already exists. Nothing unusual? In the past, when there was an aristocracy and a bourgeoisie, something unusual could be expected. But today all social classes go to almost the same schools, universities, watch the same TV series on the same TVs. Therefore they have a similar mentality. So CEOs will treat this situation almost like any other people from the middle class. Perhaps even as an attraction, an opportunity to take a break from a boring routine. Give them some debt payments car, credit, student that they just can't knock off in a month, and an overall budget just slightly more than they earn. So they have to either come up with a way to make more, cut something essential or borrow more if possible. Then send them some medical bills during the three months and maybe have an appliance break. Oh and a family friend wedding and birthday that they need to celebrate. This gets asked all the time but it should be like three months so they have to shop for an apartment they can afford and within distance to work and have to make rent a couple of times. And not really reality because they need to script in things like an unexpected car repair bill sickness so they miss work and don't get paid in the associated doctor bill, date night entertainment expenses and stuff like that. In the end, nothing. A billionaire wouldn't be on this show without having the show catering to his whims to begin with, all the average person would see is whatever the producers edit and out to have happened like with any reality TV. After a month, they go back to being a big box CEO. They would learn nothing and it would be phony and staged and edited to look like everyone could make it on a nothing salary if they just pulled back a bit on comfort. Oh I wanted some beer but it's $11 a six pack so I brewed up my own case for 97 cents. You'll never live like common people. You'll never do whatever common people do. You'll never fail like common people. You'll never watch your life slide out of view. And you dance and drink and screw. Because there's nothing else to do. Social and personal growth The experience could lead to personal growth and transformation for the CEO, fostering a greater sense of social responsibility and a commitment to addressing workplace inequalities. Duh. They would freak the fuck out probably within 20 minutes. As soon as they go to buy breakfast from Dunkin' and realize they just spent a large portion of their food budget. You'd never get one to do it. What are you going to do? Give them more money. Unless they're that stupid cough, Elon cough they know they would just end up looking stupid. That WGA strike has producers scrambling for any idea, eh? Anyways, no. Reality TV is fucking lame, and your shitty idea contributes nothing to how fucked up salaries are. I doubt any CEOs would do it. They'd be well aware of how it would look. They don't want to acknowledge the disparity. Only if they make it longer than a month. Make it six months at least and they also have to do the job of their employee. This is similar to Undercover Boss except it will be for an entire month. I think it will be worth watching though. I would, but only if it's an entire year. Otherwise there won't be enough time for all the issues life has to offer. The point of this is to try and appeal to their empathy, for which they have none. So nothing will happen. The billionaire has an assistant that would make sure nothing changed at all for him or her. I'd pay to see that bonus round they have to navigate the annual office secret Santa too. Jeez. 
I would produce it myself if that meant not seeing this question every other day. It would just end up as a planned PR stunt to make the rich asshole look sympathetic. Op is about copying and pasting a very unoriginal and repeated question on this sub. Day 1 CEO tries to buy a Starbucks. Day 2 CEO learns what instant coffee is. I will be interested, make it 90 days. I think they would cheat. I would not. But I imagine nothing of any value would happen. They'd treat it like a camping trip. Make it a year.